Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm going to attempt to create a short piece of cinematic music completely from scratch as well as get a music video together to accompany this track. Doing it all myself, I'm just gonna get some B-roll, throw it with the music. Uh, it's currently half two, so I've left it a little bit late. I'm giving myself the day to do it. I'm probably gonna have to get some shots later this evening once the track is done, but I'm gonna show you a bit of the process. Let's just get straight into it. This is gonna be a fun little challenge. Okay, so first thing is first, I need to grab my keyboard and my stand. One keyboard, one stand. I'm going to find an ambient pad to use as the background of my track. So the main pad that is going to create the overall atmosphere and mood for the piece of music that I'm about to create. I'm going to have a little flick through some options now. I'm going to choose one. Too harsh. It's nice, but I'm not too keen on the fuzz behind it. I can EQ that out in post, but I want to try and get this done as soon as possible. So I'm trying to make this as quick of a process as I possibly can for me as I've given myself the challenge to make this track in only a day. Too harsh. That sounds too prominent for me. I want it more underlying in the background. I like that one. It's soft, it sets a mood, and I can turn it down, and I can push it more in the background to just use as an overall sort of ambience, which I'm looking for, so I'm gonna use that sound. Okay, so I have manipulated the pad slightly. I've transposed it by minus one semitone, and I've added a little bit of sort of texture, high-end texture in the background, a little bit of vinyl crackle, and we've got this. So we're rolling with that. Now time to add the orchestral elements. Okay, so I've chosen a sustained oboe that I'm gradually sort of gonna introduce into the track. Well, I think I am anyway. I'm at least gonna use it in the intro. Um, let's go tracking this thing. Gonna let it roll on for another beat before I come in. Now. That's a nice start. I'm gonna quantize that. I'm gonna add some volume automation so it gives the oboe a more human feel rather than sounding quite robotic and so to the dot. Uh, and then we're gonna see what can follow on from there. I'm thinking maybe another instrument to complement that melody. So maybe uh, a cello or something, but, but we'll have a look. Okay, so now I'm using some sustained basses, which are doing a kind of harmony. One is uh, a lower octave, and then I've got another bass on top, which is doing a higher octave. So I'm gonna try this to accompany the oboe and see how this sounds. It's getting there guys, it's getting there. Okay guys, I've added a little bell pattern in, sort of Christmassy sounding bell with a new melody from the oboe accompanying that bell sound. And now I'm gonna sort of incorporate a new bass melody to, to add some low end and really fill in the sounds. But this is a little snippet of what I've just added. And now I'm going to add some sustained bass to fill out again that low end. Okay, the bass has been inserted and now it's time to sort of progress this track with a, a little bit of a middle section I'm feeling maybe and then really build it up to its uh, crescendo and peak point. Um, so let's see what we can get creating. Okay guys, so I've added a bass sustain section to fill in the middle section and then I've actually brought in some violas to reach a crescendo towards the end here. Ignore it says bass is sustain, that's just because I've copied a MIDI clip but this is actually a viola sound. I will play you it from here to give you a little sneak peek before I actually play the whole track. And uh, I need to film a video as well, I need to film an actual music video for it. But this is what I've got now. Okay. 
Okay, that's all you're getting so far, guys. I ain't even gonna show you what I end up making for the ending. I'm just gonna just gonna give you the whole track, all right? I don't wanna let the process drag on too much, but I'm, I'm almost there, I'm almost there. So we're gonna finish this off. I'm gonna get on and uh, fine tune some things. Don't wanna show you all the boring parts of me doing all the volume automation and EQing and stuff, that's boring. Um, save that for another time. And yeah, I need to get a music video done. So I'm gonna go out and film some cinematics, try and suit the mood of this uh, song. And, and yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the finished product, guys. This is exciting. This has been a big challenge for me and I hope it actually turns out all right and this video gets uploaded. We'll see anyway. <laughs> Let me know what you think.